Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming to you with a collab called The Purge and it's hosted by Diva Designing on a Dime by Kimberly Davis. What we're supposed to do is purge our house of some unwanted and unneeded things. So that's what I'm about to do. Come along with me and I will show you what I'm getting rid of and why and what I'm going to do with it. So I'm hoping to inspire you to purge your house as well. So let's get started. I have this big box from Sam's Club and I'm going to try to fill it. This picture frame had my husband's senior picture in it. I do not want it or need it. I did keep the picture. So out it goes. It's actually got velvet around it. I wonder if somebody would want to put an Elvis picture in it. <laughs> That's going into the box. This cute little picture frame. It's got butterflies on it. Donating. I have three movies that I don't want to ever watch again. Donating. This record book, it says Simplex Record. Um, it's just a blank book. Every time I've purged, probably for the last three times, I've come across this and I said to myself, I could use that for anything. It's just paper, but do I ever use it? No, so I'm donating that. This next item I'm gonna give to a friend of ours. He told me before, if we have ever have any old hymnals, he wants them. So this says Tabernacle Hymns number five. He likes to sing and he likes to sing a lot of the old hymns. So that will be going to our friend. This item came out of my five, not five dollar. This item came out of my one dollar bin that I purchased. If you'd like to see that video, I will link it below in the description box. It was a really interesting video. So I'm not really sure what it is, but uh, I don't have a use for that. So I'm going to get rid of that. Donate. This sparkly big pencil. Thought some kid would like that. Donating that. This box. Any guesses as to what is in here? It's an old fashioned keyboard. I say old fashioned because most people have laptops. Yeah, laptops. Most people have laptops now. Uh, I have a laptop and I don't think I'm ever going back to a PC. So I'm going to donate the keyboard. I got this game at a garage sale for a buck. It really wasn't a favorite, so I'm going to donate it. This came with my bottle of Shout. I don't know if somebody could use it or not. I never used it. Donating that. Some craft stones. Don't need those. Here I have a whole box from cleaning out my sewing kit that I don't need. I'm being real here. I am not a sewer, never intend to be, okay? I've got this cute little sewing kit. If I can open it without it going everywhere, I'll show you. It's adorable. It's got a little uh, ruler at the top, a little pair of scissors, a tape measure, a bunch of little teeny tiny spools of thread and some things that I don't know what to do with. So I'm going to donate that. This was the trim for when we made our own balances in the living room. I've had it for probably 25 years. I don't think I need it. And these were um, from a dress that my mom made me when I was a little girl. Material. It's, it's like a bunch of letters. Super cute. Maybe somebody can use that fabric. This is a little pin cushion. I have a couple sewing accessories that I haven't used since I was in high school and took sewing class. Some more of the little pencils, more accessories for sewing. Um, this I believe is snaps. I wouldn't know how to use them. These are little tags. They're adorable. 
especially handmade by Carol. I'm not going to sew anybody anything. And then I think this is for making jewelry, which I do not do. A little um, chain, gold chain. And then the rest is oddball colors of thread. If I'm going to sew something, it's not going to be these colors. And really all I know how to do is sew a button on. And that's frustrating. So, I'm donating all that. I found this cute little tin in my den. It's from Burt's Bees. I thought somebody might like that. So I'm donating that. And then this I've used for years in my home for file folders. My husband used it for a while and now we don't have a use for it. Actually, I even used it for cookie trays at one point in time in my cupboard. So I'm donating that. And I think this is the last item. This was, um, at one time it was green. Oops, I just broke it. I can fix that. It was green and like a hunter green. It was from Bath and Body Works and it had like a little gift set in it. And I painted it black and then I put this tool through the, it had holes in it already and there was rope in it. And I put tool through there and then I, I painted a white heart on it and we used it for our daughter's shower and wedding to put thank you cards in. So this item I'm checking with my daughter to see if she wants it, maybe to put toilet paper in or makeup or something like that in her bathroom and if she doesn't then I'll donate it. Thanks for joining me today for this quick little video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what I'm purging from my home and what I'm going to do with it and I hope it inspires you to purge your house. We don't need extra things sitting around that we're never going to use. Let them go and let somebody else enjoy them. Thank you so much Kimberly Davis. I enjoyed this. And I think you do this every season. So if that's the case, expect to see me again. Thanks for watching my video. And if you're coming over from Kimberly's channel, please leave me a message in the comments and let me know. And if you like my content, please consider subscribing to my channel. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. If you'd like to follow me on Instagram, I'll link that below. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye. Oh my goodness, I almost knocked you over. <laughs> I would really be in a pickle then.